Hey guys, what's up? It's your girl Berlin checking in. I'm back with another video for you guys. So today I'm going to be doing a two-part review for you. So I'll be reviewing this gel polish kit that I received um, from Amazon. And then I'll also be reviewing this UV light that I received with it as well. Well, not with it, but you know. So um, just a little background on this. This is my first actual... Um, nail review nail related review so i'm pretty excited about that um something about me i have been doing my own nails for about two years now so um i started out using you know just the regular acrylic with the just regular polish um since then i've started just using um i don't know if you can see I just started using press-ons and then I get clear press-ons and then I get the gel polish and do it that way. So, you know, I started really doing my own nails because it's just like most of the time, well, here in Iowa anyway, where I live, you know, you go to the nail salon and then they don't want to do the long nails. Like they're, they're hesitant to do the long nails for some reason and then they come out crooked or, you know, just not what you want exactly and you know it's most of the time overpriced so you know just doing it myself i can actually take my time do them however i want not to mention you guys it is so much cheaper so i get a pack of press on nails it's like 500 in a pack for like five dollars off of amazon and you can literally paint them any type of way you can bling them out whatever so yeah um that's just a little bit about me and my nail history <laughs> But anyway, you guys, okay, so I'm going to go ahead and get started on this one first. Um, I'm going to actually move this to the side for a minute. All right, you guys, so this, I want to say it's called Zishi. I'll make sure I put the link in the description box below. But you guys, I absolutely love this packaging. Oh gosh, my light is messing it up. Hopefully you can see it a little bit. I absolutely love this packaging. It is so freaking cute. Um, so, you know, it's just got their name on there. Um, it comes with 20 polishes and then also three um, additional polishes. So that's good. Um, here in the front, they have like a little thing. Oh gosh, you can't see it. But they have like a little thing where you can like put little samples of each color. So that way you know exactly what's in the box. Um, I'm not going to show you guys all the colors um, individually. Um, however, I will make sure I insert a clip here just to um, show you guys all the colors. You guys, they have so many colors in here. Like, you can't go wrong with this set, I'm telling you. So, I wish I would have did a like true unboxing with you guys, but I wasn't doing YouTube at the time. So, so just opens up, you know, here. Um, I have used this quite a bit, you guys, and I think I even lost one. <laughs> but yeah, that's how it looks. So I love, love, love the packaging. Um, so you see it comes kind of like that. In its own. Each polish comes with its own individual box, which I love. I love that. Um, so along with the 20 colors, it also came with a base coat. A top coat and then what I thought was really cool it came with a matte top coat which is bomb you guys so um, this is how the actual bottle looks each bottle looks just like this so I think that's good um, I was worried that it was gonna be like small bottles but this is actually you guys this is actually a nice size bottle to me you know, and um, I've done some other people's nails, well, just a couple people's nails, and then I've also done mine, and I'm not even close to running out, so, yeah. Um, this does have a pretty thick consistency also, you guys. Like, this is my favorite color, if y'all can't tell. <laughs> so, um, it's like a pretty thick consistency, you guys. So usually I only do, um, usually I only do two coats of it. 
because yeah i only do two coats of it just to kind of preserve it but then also it's just like that's all you need like if you guys can see my nails i only have two coats on Ooh. <laughs> okay so yeah so then um in here it also comes with a user manual which I like um, basically it's just telling you how to shape your nails how to file them down how to just get them fully prepared before you put on the gel nail polish so I thought that was pretty helpful because this was actually the first time that I even used gel polish so that was very helpful um this also did come with but y'all i don't know where they even at right now but um they did come with also three different kinds of nail files so like one was probably like a buffer it was like a pretty smooth surface but it still did a little something maybe i don't know what that was for but yeah it comes with three different files and they're good quality files i wish i could find them i don't know they got lost in the sauce somewhere y'all but yeah so there's that um, what else did I want to say about this? So I think this comes from the brand. I want to say it's called Horson or something like that. It's on Amazon. Um, I'll put the link down below. I believe that's what the name was. But the box says Zishi on it. Um, so about this thing too also. Um, I ordered this on a Wednesday. And I got it on a Saturday. So that was pretty fast shipping for me. I was definitely satisfied with it. Um, and then I did have a couple of questions for the um, seller. Um, they were very quick getting back to me. So I would say their customer service is A1 for sure. Um, this whole entire kit was $25.99. Um, I didn't have to pay shipping with it because I ordered through Amazon Prime. So... Um, with taxes, I want to say it was like roughly $27, maybe. So not bad at all for literally all these polishes, you guys. I would definitely order this again. You know what I'm saying? This is like, to me, it's like a must-have kit. It's got your black, white, silver, gold, and then it's like all the neon colors. Just, it goes on and on, you guys. So, yeah, that's, I would definitely recommend it. Now, I do have just a couple of cons to this but overall the, the good outweighs the bad so the cons with this first off would be the um, top coat the shiny top coat so from my understanding this was supposed to be a no wipe top coat which means that you know once you cure it with your UV light that it's not supposed to still be sticky it's just supposed to be cured hard you know you can just go about your business so with this top coat you guys i noticed like i was curing it for like 60 seconds and then i'll touch it it's still kind of sticky i'm like okay so then i cure it again for like 60 seconds still sticky and this is the top coat so i'm like okay maybe i just need to wait a few minutes and then it will harden up on its own but then you guys, like an hour would pass, like an hour would pass and I was still, like it would still be kind of sticky to the touch. Um, you know, like if I were to touch my shirt or something like that, then little fibers would come off on the nails. So that's something I don't like. But I did come to realize though that if I wash my hands and then um, like rub the hand soap all over the nails after I do it, that literally um causes it to harden up for some reason so i don't know if that's just like a mistake in the description that they did on amazon or if i was doing something wrong because like i said that is my first time actually doing it so um that's like one of the cons for me i would just like to do it and get up and go about my business um so another thing that i don't really like is that um, you don't really know exactly what the color is unless you like write down all the, they have like little codes for each one at the top. So this one says like A816. But I would love if they just 
like have the bottle clear. So like, where'd that bottle go? There's some gel polishes that I've seen and it actually has like a little preview window there. So you can actually see the color inside. So sometimes, you know, especially if I'm in a rush, if I've been doing somebody else's nails, then I'll just throw them back in random boxes to, um, you know, pack them away and then I forget. So, because I did label, like I labeled each box. So whatever color is in here, I put just a little patch of it on the outside of the box. So it'll help me, you know, recognize it a little better. So, I mean, I had to do that, but that was pretty time consuming. Um, I had to like, you know, go one by one. So I would have loved to have a preview window there. Um, let's see. I'm trying to think of anything else on this product. You guys, overall, you see just a couple of cons. So, I absolutely love, 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 love this kit. I definitely recommend it. Very well priced. Wide variety of colors. You guys will not be disappointed at all. So, yeah. There's that for you. All right, you guys, so now let's get into this UV light, honey. So I ordered this one off of Amazon also. And this is my first UV light, so I really don't have a lot to compare it to anyway. But, um, you know, I've definitely seen, like, other reviews and things like that. So, yeah, this is pretty simple, straightforward. So with this UV light, I ordered this off of Amazon on a Tuesday and I received it Thursday so that's amazing um, I also put the link in the description box below for you guys if you want to purchase this um, I got this UV light for it was eleven dollars and ninety nine cents um, and I got it through Amazon Prime so it probably came up to like twelve something thirteen at the most um, but yeah you know um, of course I got it in my pretty pink because I love pink so, um, you see on it, it says star, UV light, blah, blah, blah. So it's got, um, the only thing I didn't like about this is it didn't come with a block. So I had to just use one that I had, like just an old block that I had to plug it in, which is fine. Cause I mean, this is so cheap. Like, I mean, you know, cheap in price, not quality. So it comes with a little USB plug. You have to plug that in. Um, I would say, you guys, this is really good, especially for the price. It's got um, the three settings. I don't know if you can see that. Um, it's three settings, so it'll do it for 30 seconds, 60 seconds, and 90 seconds. So I thought that was awesome. Um, I usually just use the 60 seconds, though. Um, what else? I also think it's pretty cool that um, the light doesn't, well, unless you, like, actually press the button. But like say for instance when I'm doing my nails and I just press this button, the 60 second button just the first time that I slide my hand in. And what I think is so cool is that, you know, I don't have to push the button every single time. Once you push it and turn it on one time, every time you slide your hand under, the light will come on. So I think that's really convenient, especially like when I'm in a rush. I don't feel like just, you know, doing all that. You just stick your hand in and it's done. Now, y'all. This is what I wish somebody would have told me about this, about UV lights, period. Okay, so first time I did, okay, so first time I did my nails, right, with this stuff. So, you know, I'm the type of girl, she's got to be matching. She's got to be matching. So every time I do my nails, my toenails have to be the same color. So I'm like, okay, same rules probably apply from the fingers to the toes. No, no, you guys. So I put this gel polish on my toes. Now, first of all, I didn't know that the base coat is going to be sticky. I thought the base coat was supposed to get dry before I even put on any color on top of it. Wrong. Y'all, this base coat is going to be sticky, but that's how it's supposed to be. So then the color will adhere to it better. So that's the reason why it's still sticky. I did not know that. You see, I just wasn't reading the instructions. So, you guys, I cured my toes just the base coat. 
like 60 seconds, but like three times. Finally, it just wasn't drying up. It was still tacky. So I'm just like, okay, let me just keep it moving. You guys. So then, so by, by, the, by the time I was fully done, y'all, I probably cured my toenails for 60 seconds. Probably like six or seven times. So y'all, I get to, you know, going about my business that day, you know, nails looking fire, toes looking fire, you know, I, I was living life, I was doing it, <laughs> and y'all, when I tell y'all my toenails was hurting so bad, you guys, like, I wish I could show you a picture, like, honestly, but that would be so embarrassing, but y'all, my toes was hurting so bad, my toenails, just, just on my big toes, my nail beds, they were hurting. So I'm like, okay, I thought it was the shoes that I had because I had just bought some new shoes from Foot Locker. You know, sometimes the shoes will like clamp down on your toes if they are new. And that's the problem I was having with them shoes. So I just assumed like, okay, it's just, you know, because of that. As the days went by, you guys, my toes was on fire all the time, y'all. To where I had to like take some ibuprofen just to, um, just to you know ease the pain a little bit like it was bad but then you know i'm just like okay no pain no gain you guys when i took that polish off of my toes my toenail beds was like dark like almost black y'all you can burn yourself with you can burn your nail beds with this light so therefore you guys make sure you follow instructions if you did not know, because I didn't know y'all. I'm just a beginner with this. You know what I'm saying? Well, I was at the time. Y'all. And like still to this day, like now I only use, because I didn't know if I was like allergic to the gel polish or just something. I don't know what it was, but it turned out it was this. You know, so like now I'm just using my regular polish. But even like now, because it's still healing. Like it's like literally like a scab up under my, okay, it's just, I'm doing a lot. Don't judge me. You just came here for the review. Yeah. Okay, y'all. So anyway, but yeah, you guys. And then also, um, I did want to mention, um, this is a 24 watt. Um, this is a 24 watt UV light. Um, also, this came with three files. Also, so that was perfect. Um, yeah. So if you guys have any questions on these items or anything like that, just make sure you. Um, put it in the comments down below. I'll make sure I get right back to you guys. Um, I do want to thank you guys for tuning in with me. Um, you guys, I just started doing YouTube like four days ago. You guys, it has definitely been a bumpy road already. Um, check out some of my other videos and you'll see exactly why I say that. Um, but yeah. Um, so you guys, I'm going to go ahead and, um, in this review, um, I'll put the links in the description box below, like I said before. Um, and yeah, so you guys just make sure you go ahead and like, share, subscribe to my channel. Also, make sure you hit that bell. Check in with me in the comments down below and I'll see you again the next video.